Good evening, everyone. Uh, one special utility district, uh, special meeting of the Board of Directors, November 16, 2022, at 7.45 p.m. Uh, item number one, call to order. 1A, roll call, Esmeralda Solis, present. Maribel Diaz, present. Mr. Jose Luis Ochoa, Jr. Present. Uh, Ms. Ana Maria Perez. Present. Mr. Ricardo Perez. Here. Dr. Adriana Flores Villarreal. Present. Mr. Homer Tijerina. Absent. And um, that's it. Well, we do have a quorum. Moving on to item number 1B, invocation will be given by Ms. Pam Perez. Item number 1C, Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. <coughs> Item number 1D, Public Comments. Oh, Madam President, we do not have any public comments. Okay, thank you, Mr. Salinas. So item number two is to reconvene the board meeting. Um, it's at 7.47 p.m. Um, before I go into item number three, um, I would just like to take a minute. Um, this will be officially my last meeting for Awasud as a uh, board president. Um, I just currently won the election uh, to serve as the uh, board member for La Jolla ISD Place 2. Um, so I just want to take a minute and I'll make it brief, uh, but I just want to take a minute to let everybody know at Awasud that it has been an honor for myself to have served Awasud. Uh, for the two years that I have served, uh, one of them uh, in the capacity as president of the board. Um, I want to thank the general manager, um, Mr. Salinas, thank you very much for your guidance throughout the time that I have been here, as well as all the staff and the rest of my colleagues on the board uh, for allowing me uh, to have served as your president for the last year of, of, of my time here at Awasad. Um It has been an honor for me. Um, I was a, uh, stays with a piece of my heart, uh, but I carry on to our La Jolla district um, with much pride, and I will carry on my duties uh, serving the community in that capacity. So with that being said, um, I want to move into item number three, and that is discussion and possible action on the election of officers for our SUD Board of Directors, and that would be for President, Vice President, Secretary, and Treasurer. Um, I don't know if there's any nominations on the table uh, for any of these items. Um, I myself have a recommendation and a nomination for um, Treasurer um, uh, that I personally would like to recommend Mr. Ricardo Perez as the treasurer. Um, he is our, uh, very good with finance and he's been doing a, an outstanding job here throughout the time that I have been here. So that is my recommendation for the uh, treasurer position. Um, for the secretarial position, I am recommending Mr. Jose Luis Ochoa Jr. Uh, and for the vice president position, I am recommending um, Ms. Uh, Dr. Adriana Flores Villarreal. And currently, the current vice president of our board is uh, Ms. Maribel Diaz. And I am recommending um, the president position for uh, Ms. Maribel Diaz. That is the nomination that's on the table. It is open for discussion if anybody has 
any other nominations that they may want to do at this time, it's open for that. So, Does anyone else have any nominations? I would like to nominate myself for secretary. Okay. So we have a nomination from Ms. Uh, Perez for secretary. So therefore, I am going to go down the list. Um, uh, as far as treasurer, was there any other nominations for treasurer? No. So with that being said, there was a nomination on the table for treasurer to be Mr. Ricardo Perez. So is there everyone in favor of Mr. Perez uh, being the treasurer of the new restructuring of the board? <coughs> And I would need a motion. <coughs> Excuse yes. me. I'm going to call <coughs> a motion uh, for Mr. Ricardo Perez for treasurer for Alba Support. I okay. second the motion. So I have a motion by Ms. Diaz, and that is to appoint Mr. Ricardo Perez as the treasurer. And I have a second by uh, Ms. Villarreal. All those in favor say aye. 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 Anyone oppose? Aye. Okay. Motion carries. So. The treasurer will be Mr. Ricardo Perez from District 6. Um, the next one will be for secretary. Um, the motions on, well, not the motions, but the nominations on the table is uh, one given by myself for Mr. Jose Luis Ochoa Jr. And there's also a nomination uh, by Ms. Ana Maria Perez. So do I have a motion to... How would I handle as far as if there's two? Do I um, have a raise of, of hands? Who's I would call for voting? motion for the voting and then vote all eyes for one candidate and eyes for the other candidate and then whoever wins that vote. That way we have a okay. singular motion for the vote. Okay. So I'm going to um, go ahead and run that for and, the first. I'd like to just make a comment if I can. Yes, ma'am, of course. And the reason I'm nominating myself is I think that we're all a brand new board. And I think we should maybe talk and discuss a little bit about what qualifies us to go ahead and, and serve that position. And I feel like my district, there's a lot going on with my district, and I really want to be in the know. And uh -huh. if those positions, what I really don't know if there's like an executive cabinet or executive committee that does mm -hmm. find out more about um things that are happening with the district okay that's that's my reason for making that motion for mm -hmm. nominating myself nothing against mr yeah. Chaw, but i, oh, I no. think I, I i have a lot of experience i think palmview we have a lot of infrastructure that that is clear and present that needs our attention and i'd like to be in the know of that and i am in agreement i'm in agreement with you miss perez um on that um <clears throat> at the same time i do feel that um uh, as a board member, regardless of if we have any of the executive positions um, for the board, um, I think we're all uh, very open to have that communication with everyone amongst ourselves. Um, Awasud is very good about forming uh, different, uh, and I'm giving you information based on the amount of time that I've been here and the experience that I've had during the time that I've served, served Awasud. Uh, <clears throat> as far as workshops and committees to be able to create and especially when um, it's going to pertain to certain districts and what is happening within our within those districts uh, for example uh, one of our main uh, projects uh, and I think everybody's very well aware of that is our sewer project in Palmview um, and I think that there's other board members uh, present um, that will vouch uh, for that. And what I'm about to say, that the that our SUD has always uh, created committees within the board members uh, to be able to, and also specifies and goes towards the the directors that service those areas to be part of those committees. And that way you're well aware of what, what, what would be going on. So I that, that is another I just option. didn't like, or not so much didn't like, it just it looks like everything was already pre-done. Yeah. And so I, I wasn't given the opportunity mm, to speak no. 
myself or to have something oh no definitely and that's why we have it in open session mm -hmm. right now uh because this was just a nomination from myself uh personally um <clears throat> leaving that's a recommendation that I'm giving on behalf of myself and I have opened it up for anyone else that has any recommendations or was willing to give any nominations for, for those particular positions. And um, since, since you did nominate yourself, <clears throat> by all means, we will take a vote on who wants to nominate either of the two candidates that were selected as nominations. Um, I don't know if, if I answered part of the questions that you may have had and if not we're welcome to have the attorneys uh, <clears throat> intervene if I may have not answered something that well, that was only, was a question yeah, the only thing I would add is we do have a Palmview executive committee that I think <clears throat> we'll have to reappoint because I believe Madam President you were on that exactly uh, so we will have to reappoint a board member to that committee yeah. And I know that our SUD uh, and the staff is uh, very good about making sure, like I had mentioned about those committees, to make sure that when these meetings are going to be coming up, and I, we will bring them back up so that we can make sure that the committees are set and that the, per the people that are representing that district are, are part of those committees. Yes, yeah, I would hope to be on that district since it is my district. Yes. Yes, so um, I hope I, I answered uh, some of your questions, and if not, if you have any other, uh, any other questions, or if there isn't any other questions from any of the rest of the board members, then I will take this uh, up for a vote on vote. both of the nominations. We need the motion for the vote on those two nominations. Okay, so I would need a motion for the two nominations for the secretarial position, and that will be for Ms. Ana Maria Perez uh, and Mr. Jose Luis Ochoa Jr. I'll make the motion. Okay, so I have a motion by Ms. Uh, Perez. I need a second. I second. And I have a second by uh, Mr. Ochoa. So now I can go into the <laughs> voting. <laughs> Okay, so we're going to go ahead and start with Miss Ana Maria Perez. Um, a vote for the secretarial position. I'll vote for myself. Okay. Uh, anyone oppose? Aye. Well, I think we just vote. Just it. Eyes for her and eyes for her. Okay, and then Mr. Jose Luis Ochoa Jr. Aye. 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 Okay, so I have four votes uh, for Mr. Jose Luis Ochoa Jr. And I have uh, one vote for Ms. Ana Maria Perez. Uh, with that being said, um, do I have to do a motion to, to approve Mr. Jose Luis Ochoa Jr.? They, they They've already voted on that. So, and, okay. right, okay. So I have a motion by uh, Ms. Perez and then I had the second by Mr. Ochoa. So. All those in favor <coughs> said aye and yes, so motion carries. Now we're going on to the vice president uh, position. Um, the one nomination that was on the table was for um, Dr. Adriana Flores uh, Villarreal. Do we have any other nominations on the table? Do we? Okay, I have a motion by uh, Mr. Perez. I second the motion. And then I have a second by Ms. Diaz. All those in favor? Aye. Aye. Anyone oppose? Motion carries. And then I have the uh, nomination for the president position, and that will be for Ms. Maribel Diaz. Do I have any other nominations for the president position? So I would need a motion for mm -hmm. the president, and that is uh, a motion by Mr. Perez. I second the motion. And I have a second by Dr. Villarreal. All those in favor? Aye. 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 <clears throat> motion carries. 
moving on to uh i guess at this point i will um turn over my position to the new board president and that is Ms. maribel diaz and she will uh finish the remaining part of this meeting thank you everyone Um, good evening. Uh, thank you, everybody, for joining us tonight. Um, with uh, that being said, um, we move into item number four, discussion and possible action to revise the date and time of our said board meetings. Uh, yes, uh, Madam uh, President. Uh, at this time, uh, our said uh, board meetings are held uh, the first Monday of the month at 6 uh, p.m., this was an item that was put on the agenda on the agenda for uh, board discussion if they would like to continue uh, with the first Monday of the month at 6 p.m. Is there any discussion on? on yeah, do we have any um, any discussions? Anybody have a different proposition? Or is everybody okay with that? Is everybody okay with Mondays at 6 p.m. for the meeting? Yes. Okay, I'm, I'm okay. Okay, do we have a motion? So move. Uh, second. Second. Okay. Um, okay, we can uh, forward. Yes, just for the record. Just, just for the record, uh, we have a we have a motion oh, okay. made by Ms. Sara Maria Perez, and a second by Mr. Rick Perez. Thank you. Okay, number five. Uh, discussion on possible. Oh, all in favor. I'm sorry, Aye. all in favor? Aye. 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 Okay. Excellent, motion passes. Okay, motion passes. Uh, number five, uh, item number five, discussion and possible action on selection of the date and time for the budget workshop. Uh, yes, uh, Madam President, uh, members uh, of the board, uh, we are scheduling a budget workshop uh, here in the coming uh, weeks. You have a calendar with you. I just wanted to get a, 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 a I guess, a consensus of a, of a, a date that will best fit uh, your schedule, so that we can have the budget uh, workshop. We need to adopt adopt the budget uh, here in December, before the end of the year. So uh, we have a calendar. I know that Thanksgiving is coming up uh, here uh, next week, so probably uh, the week of uh, the end of the November, November 28th to. Uh, December 3rd or the following week which will be from uh, December uh, 5th uh, through December 10th uh, historically or the last budget meeting that we had we had it on a Saturday uh, from 9 to uh, 11 or 9 to noon we can have this budget uh, workshop uh, in the afternoon as well during the week uh, from I don't know 5 to 8 uh, p.m. Uh, it depends how the, the, the board uh, feels to, to have that meeting and if everybody's in agreement with a, with a time and a date that fits uh, everybody. So any recommendations uh, from the board and we can, we can discuss, of course. You want the date and the time, right? The date and the time, yes. I mean, Madam Chair, I mean, I don't know what date you want, Monday or November or December, but we need to do it as soon as possible so yes. we can get everybody up to par, especially as a new board member. During the week? Oh, would you all like during the week or a Saturday? Or it can be on a Saturday morning mm -hmm. as well. During the week in the evening? Yeah. Or is everybody okay with that? Yes. Mm -hmm. um, maybe the week of the 28th through the 2nd? Uh, what day? I don't know what day uh, would be best for? We have, uh, we can have it, of course, uh, and, and this is my, my opinion and suggestion, probably the week of the 28th, uh, November 28th through either uh, December 2nd, or we can have it the following week, which would be uh, yeah. December 5th through December 9th. Uh, any of those days will be uh, perfect so that we can have, uh, okay. of course, a special okay. meeting to adopt okay. the, yes, the budget possible. afterwards. What days? For me, I'm open every day. I mean, any day would be On Tuesdays, I have basketball games with my son. Okay. okay. Tuesdays after. So okay. 29 and 60. How about the 30th? Everybody okay with the 30th? That's the Wednesday after Thanksgiving? Mm -hmm. okay. November 30th? 
At six? <coughs> okay, so, yes. So November 30th at 6 p.m.? Yes. For the workshop, the finance workshop? Yes. We're good? Okay. It should take from two to three hours. Two to three hours. I don't know if you want to start earlier at five or at six is fine. Uh, five. Five? Okay, five. Five p.m.? Uh, well, I get out until five. 530? 530 would be better. 530 would be okay. <clears throat> okay. Well, uh, we'll put it for 530 p.m. Uh, November 30th. <clears throat> we'll schedule for that. Okay, I make a motion uh, for, for a budget workshop for November 30th. No, no, I'm sorry. Um, I need a motion for, I need a motion for a budget workshop for recommended for November 30th at 5.30 p.m. So move. Second. Okay, we have um, a motion by Ms. Dr. Adriana Villarreal second. and a second by Mr. Rick Bettis. All in favor, say aye. 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 Okay, any opposed? Motion, motion carries. Um, item number six, executive session. Yeah, Madam President, uh, we do not have any items um, for numbers uh, for six, so we can move on to uh, adjournment unless there's anything else. Okay, uh, item number seven, adjournment. I need a motion to adjourn at 8.07 p.m. So move. Second. Okay, I have a motion from uh, Ms. Ms. Maria, Ana Maria Perez and a second from uh, Mr. Ochoa. All those in favor? Aye. Aye. Okay. Motion carries. Meeting adjourns at 8.07 p.m. Thank you all. Thank you. Thank you, Jen. Thank you.